Hello everyone, so today as you can see I've got my art supplies, we're going to be doing something a little bit different today. Today we're going to be doing some intuitive art reading, I'm not exactly sure what the exact name of this is but basically I'm going to be telling you what the next 30 days are going to be like for you by reading the artwork. So we have group number one with the amethyst, group two with the rough rose quartz and group three with the copper sphere. So please choose whichever crystal you're drawn to and let's see what's happening for you guys in the next 30 days. So starting off with group number one with the beautiful amethyst cluster. Hello group number one. So let's get started with your reading. As you can see, my water is already red. I did try to do your reading. Didn't work out. This is the first time I'm doing this. So we're gonna, we're gonna try again. So in the next 30 days, let's see what's going on for you guys. So let me prep the paper first. I'm just going to plop loads and loads of water on here. I do feel like for you guys, your, the mess, some of the messages that I got were traffic light colours. I feel like you guys are really, really working on your sacral and your solar plexus. And I feel like you're really learning to embrace the madness. I'm hearing embrace the madness, embrace the intensity. A lot of you guys I'm picking up are definitely Aries. A lot of you guys are really big fire signs and I'm a water sign so I can really pick up on that contrast between my like wateriness and your fieriness. I do feel like if you guys aren't a fire sign there's definitely energy around wanting to shift forward but don't don't know how. So for you guys it's really really important for you to really work on this energy and move it through as you can. So exercise is going to be really really good for you and I'm just picking up on colours I'm naturally drawn to. So I'm going to zoom you in as I'm doing this because it's so freaking pretty. So let me show you how this goes. There's definitely energy of like moving into a new space. And I do feel like there's three people who are going to be really significant in your life in the next 30 days. So these could be two mother, it could be two types of mother figures. It could be two types of parents, it could be friendships, but I definitely feel drawn to the reds, the yellows, the oranges, that type of thing. So I'm just using inks right now. And I feel the need to like merge these colors together. Let's get some more water on there. Okay. So I feel like for you guys to expand yourself, so there's anything you've wanted to do in the past few days, then definitely start something new. There's like a new hobby that wants to come through. So if there's anything you really want to go towards, definitely do that. So I definitely feel like you guys, a lot of you are star seeds. A lot of you guys are definitely intergalactic people. And there's definitely energy of like finding your soulmate, finding your soul tribe. I feel like there's, this kind of reminds me of a caterpillar as well. So I feel like there's definitely energy of like, finding people who really mix well with you, people who are on your tribe, who are on your wavelength. So I do see around March time for you, whenever you're watching this, this is a timeless reading. So in the next three months, I do feel there's gonna be some tribal energy coming towards you, some new people. And I do feel that guy, guys, you guys need to ground yourself. There's definitely energy of you connecting to your heart chakra. So I definitely feel like you guys are really needing to ground yourself, really, really need to ground yourself. That is gorgeous. I love that, the way that's just kind of like gone out. I'm just gonna shift the water around the paper a little bit. See if that changes it, whoa, ah, that's beautiful. I love this. There's definitely energy of you guys need to spread your wings as well, like really spread your energy around. And I feel like for you guys who are extra sensitive, really time for you to focus on your energy. I know how much you wanna share it with other people, but it's really, really important for you to focus on yourself because if your energy is scattered, you're not gonna have much energy for you, okay? So I do feel you guys are gonna, there's gonna be a few friends that are gonna leave your life quite soon. Um, if you are really holding on to some things that aren't serving you, the universe is gonna draw them out of your life, away from you. I'm gonna bring that out again. Um, it's gonna draw these people away from you and I do feel like you'll need to get into a grounded place. There's just a massive energy around, you guys have this really strong, powerful energy about you. And I do feel like there's this real big need for you to put that energy somewhere because you do you are getting quite frustrated and your heart chakra is really wanting to come out and share this energy with you. Okay, let's use a couple more inks. 
so I'm asking I'm hearing you guys are asking about your love life so a lot of you guys are single who are watching this and the universe is saying it's coming towards you okay the universe is saying it is coming towards you it is coming it's there it's getting itself ready so for a lot of you who've been single for quite a few years there is definitely a new tribe coming in I do feel like there's a new person who wants to make themselves known so if you guys this is for a lot of you guys who are about over about 20 21 to 24 this is going to resonate with you the most those of you who have, are wanting to start a new project as well, you're going to meet lots of new people who want to come into your energy, okay? Let me just shift this around again. There's a definitely energy, this kind of reminds me of um, the chest, like a female chest. So I do feel like you guys um, possibly are thinking about enhancing that area or there could be like buying new underwear or something like that. There's something just, something that's quite you know, normal, but it's coming through in the reading. So it's obviously quite significant. Maybe for you guys, when you, the fact that you're quite young, maybe it's like you're buying your first like new bra or something. So as you can see, this blue is really like blending in with everything. So I definitely feel like there's some sort of um, cleansing going on with you guys. There's definitely a cleansing of the old and shifting into the new. And it's really cleansing. And I do feel like it's quite scary. It's quite overwhelming, but it's quite um, intense so if you guys are really suffering with a lot of overly just over emotional just really try to work with that emotion and really try to to hold that emotion in because I do feel like this this is really cleansing for you I do feel like this is something that you'll need to just hold on to um, meditation is going to really serve you well really work on the emotions that come up and letting them come through because this energy will help you stay. There's lots, drink lots of water as well, guys. There's an the energy of like drinking a lot of water and kind of cleansing yourself. So I do, I am seeing you guys going shopping as well. So that makes sense because this is, this is, this reading is done in December. So um, most of you are going to go Christmas shopping, but this is a timeless reading. So I do feel like you guys are definitely going to have something new coming in. So this is you guys' artwork for the next 30 days. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Thank you so much for watching. And if you'd like a private reading with me, all the information is down below. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Hello, group number two. So those of you who chose the gorgeous raw pink rose quartz, let's get started with your reading. So I have prepped the paper with some water and we're just gonna see what's happening. So for you guys, I felt the need to like splatter the water. So I'm gonna do that a little bit to create a couple of like really big water droplets. So your energy is feeling quite scattered at the moment. It's feeling a bit like really overwhelming. So if you guys are feeling really overwhelmed, they're saying going out in nature is gonna be very, very, very healing for you guys, okay? So let's get started. So I'm really getting drawn to this red I feel like you guys really like pastel colours. I'm getting like really strong pinks, blues, reds, all of that type of stuff. So lots of bright, I would use pastel colours more, but I don't have that many. So let's get some yellow on there. Oops, let's get some yellow on there. Beautiful. Okay, so for you guys, I don't feel like your reading is too complicated. The last group was more intricate. I feel like your guys is you feeling much more clearer. You have gone through the clearing. I'm hearing the song Out of the Woods by Taylor Swift. I feel like you're really coming out of the woods now. You're coming away from everything that no longer serves you. And oops, you're really being drawn to mix of people who are on your wavelength. And I do see that there is some new people coming in towards you. I'm actually seeing, I'm getting a really strong connection to um, Arabia and uh, I'm hearing Arabian nights. I'm seeing this as a really strong sun. Like I'm all seeing this as the eclipse. So I do feel like around the solar eclipse, this is a timeless reading though. So if this is after the solar eclipse in December, 2020, then I do feel that like the next solar eclipse for you guys will be very, 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 very important. I do see a really strong masculine influence coming in towards you guys. It's really going to change your life. And I do see you letting go of an ex that has really hurt you. And this could be an ex-friend 
but I do feel this person is coming out of your life now. This is somebody who does not serve you, who does not need to be in your life anymore and who no longer needs to be really harboring on your energy. So I do feel you, you guys who are wanting a male in particular or a masculine energy as a romantic partner, I do see if you want this and if you want children, I'm seeing you might have three children. I'm also seeing a really strong energy around a dragon. So if you guys are really connected to dragons and fairies, unicorns, that sort of thing, I do feel as if like dragons are really, really important for like an omen. So if you see any like pictures of dragons, paintings, drawings, that sort of thing, I'm always hearing fire breath as well. So there is a type of breathing technique you can do that's called fire breath. And I feel like you guys could really serve from that. I'm also seeing that you guys need to definitely get some more sun. I know in the UK right now it is winter, so it is quite cold and dark and gloomy. But I do feel like going out in nature is really, really going to serve you. And I do see like two ways. Um, there's going to be two different ways. It's going to be a choice. In the next 30 days, you're going to have a choice of which way you want to go. And it feels like something to do with that's important to do with your life purpose. It feels like something really, really, really important. Okay, let's get some red in there again. Let's see where this is going. Okay, I feel like having flowers in your house is going to really serve you as well. I'm just going to get a little rid of that water a little bit because it's kind of overwhelming. So you guys might be kind of drowning in emotions right now. And that's kind of normal with how things are right now. So just be really, really kind to yourself. Be really extra kind to yourself because you don't want to kind of overdo it, you know. So... I feel like you guys need a good swim or a good like long bath. I feel like you guys really need just to relax. You've been really hard on yourself and it's time to just take a breather and take a breath and take some time out. I'm hearing a best friend is coming towards you or you have support of a best friend. So there is somebody who really wants to support your energy. And I do feel as if you're going to meet quite a few different people online and abroad in the next few. Uh, 30 days who are going to serve you in your network so if you guys are self-employed or if you guys are working on a certain project I do see that you guys are going to be meeting somebody uh, quite significant I am seeing um, a partnership happening in the next two to five months for a lot of you guys so really nice really really lovely obviously those of you who want a feminine same thing applies same thing for masculine and feminine and uh, this is masculine and feminine energies as well. Wow, that's beautiful. Oh my God, look how, that's, how much that's spreading. That's crazy. So I feel like you guys are going to find your purpose in the next 30 days. Or you're going to find something that really serves you. And your energy is just going to take off. It's just going to absolutely take off. I'm going to like zoom you in on this because it's so pretty. The way this is like bleeding on the page. It's really pretty. I feel like you guys have a lot of energy and you want to start a new project. So I do feel as if just go for it. Like when you get this surge of energy, just go for it. And I do see that your ideas are worth it. Okay. So if you guys think, oh, you know, my ideas aren't important. No, they are. They are really, really important. Okay. They're really important. You have a voice. You have your own mind. You have your own brain. You have your own heart. You know, all of these are important and you have these for a reason. I also see an ex coming back from the past and I feel like you guys really have to let go of this person. I feel like it's time to let go of them. And this could literally just be a massive realisation that this person just isn't good for you anymore. And, this, and I just see this massive resurgence of yourself. I see you coming into your power. I really want to just put one blob more of this blue in there. Just drag that out and see where that goes. I do see you going in a different direction as well. Like this blue has kind of gone down. I wasn't expecting it to go down. I see you guys are going in a different direction. I feel there's going to be a massive new change coming that's really unexpected. Like really unexpected. Okay. 
beautiful. So that is your reading guys. I really hope you enjoyed this little reading. Um, if you want more videos like this, please let me know. Um, I love doing artwork. I love working with watercolors. I think they're so, so, so pretty. Um, yeah, I just see things breaking away from you guys and I feel like you guys are really gonna come into your own. And there is definitely some new people coming, so don't even worry about that. If you guys are feeling single or a bit lonely, just know that things are going to manifest for you and it's, it's time now, okay? So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you'd like a private reading, all my information is down below. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Hello, group number three. Those of you who guys who chose the gorgeous copper sphere, I love this. It's so weighted and grounding absolutely love it so let's get started with your reading let's see what's coming towards you guys okay i'm getting really strong earth signs from this group so either you guys are earth signs you have earth rising sun moon mars uh or you guys are really learning to have security in your life without needing the kind of what's the word the clarification from others to know that you're on the right path Okay, and I feel like it's now time for you to experience something that's really, really grounding. And I do feel like money is super important to you, of course, but I do feel like you're coming away from material possessions. And in the next 30 days, I actually, it's interesting, I'm actually seeing you buying a lot of things, but it's almost like you don't have the same sort of at attachment that you used to. And I feel like with this bit here, it kind of reminds me of a hawk. So I feel like the hawk uh, symbolism is going to be quite significant for you guys. I'm getting like a lot of brown, like an indie is a lot of brown. I feel like if you guys have any dead flowers in your house, definitely let go of those. I feel like the need to just refresh and really clear up your energy. Really, really clear up your energy. I see you guys, if any of you guys have children, I'm seeing you guys being very influenced by your children and they're, they're kind of like telling you something that is like new information. So it feels like you're learning from them in a different way than you've ever learned from them. And for you guys, I'm really picking up a lot of earth colors. So I keep picking up browns and greens. And in the other groups, I picked up a lot of oranges, reds, things like that. So I see you sprouting your wings. I see you guys have so much more confidence and you're gonna get so much more confidence. People are gonna start noticing you and you're gonna get drawn in a different direction. So something may not work out as it's planned, but that's because it's not meant to be in that sort of area. Not You're not meant to have this on one certain way. And that's what I'm feeling. It's like this, this blob of paint here is kind of moving this. And as it's going closer towards this part, it's shifting away. So I do feel as if don't hold on to something. If something's trying to come out of your life, let it just be there. Let it just come out of your life. Let it just exit the premises and allow yourself to just be yourself. You don't want to force or push anything. You don't want to have to really aggravate anything. And for you guys, I haven't done this for any other groups, but I'm going to pull you guys a tarot card because I feel like there's something that wants to be picked up, but I need a bit of advice here. So let me just get you a tarot card. Okay, just completely, ah, I've got paint on it. <laughs> uh, where's my, where's my tissue? Okay. Okay, so you guys got the Seven of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. So this is all about you guys getting what you deserve and finally people noticing you and noticing your power. And I do feel as if you guys are working really hard and not really taking any notice of your love life. There's definitely somebody coming in who wants to really assert themselves and get, get themselves known. So if you guys are single or if you're wanting a friendship or a new collaboration with somebody, you're going to get known. Somebody's going to notice you, okay? Let's get a little bit more green in there. Definitely a new wave. I'm just, I just keep hearing surgeons, resurgence, things like that. There's just a new wave of something coming in. And I do feel as if you're really um, learning to open up your childlike energy. You're really getting drawn to things that you used to do as a child. So this could have been films, art, hobbies, things like that. Okay. I feel like you need to make the colour purple and I don't know which colours. I'm pretty sure it's red and blue 
but I feel the need to make purple and I don't know how I'm gonna do that here, but they're just saying make purple. So I feel like the color purple is really significant. That's all about your crown chakra. It's about you connecting to the divine. So I don't know if these are the right colors, but okay, that, that kind of worked, kind of worked. I don't know. They're saying put a bit of yellow in there. There's definitely um, a need to, basically saying anything you put your attention to it will expand. That is essentially, you know, earth, the earthly force, you know, how the, how the energy of the earth works. So wherever you're putting your attention, that is where your energy is going. So if you can put your attention towards something really positive, it's gonna grow. So if you guys are wanting to attract something that you've been waiting for for quite a long time, I feel like you just gotta start it. You just gotta start something because as I'm putting these two colors together, can you see how big that is? Oh my Lord. So I feel like the more you connect to your spirituality and trust that things are gonna work out, I just feel like it's gonna come naturally. And I do feel like you're gonna meet your divine counterpart. You may meet somebody younger than you as well in the next 30 days. It just really sparks interest for you. I definitely feel like it's childlike energy. It's gonna really spark some interest. I'm gonna do that one more time because that was really free and pretty. So let's do that one more time. Beautiful, I love that. That's so gorgeous. I love your group. It's really, really lovely. You've got so many different colors going on. So I love how we had the brown color underneath and then we had the blue and the purple on top. So I feel like this is all about you. The more you get grounded, and copper is a really grounding crystal. So the more you get grounded, the more you're able to ascend, the more you're able to connect. I do feel this energy of doing things that you just love, not and just for the sake of it, not for like a certain purpose. There's definitely an earth sign coming towards you guys who is most likely gonna be a Taurus. Could be Virgo or Capricorn, but I'm picking up on a really strong Taurus. And they could be a masculine or a male. Uh, somebody who just really helps you to embody your energy, which is lovely. It really helps you to em embrace who you are and to be comfortable with who you are. And I'm getting the number eight, and we do have the number eight on this paintbrush as well. So I do feel like that's quite significant for you guys. So thank you so much for watching your reading. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I have private readings down below. My rates are down below. So if you're interested, all that is down below. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll speak to you very soon. Much love. Bye.